Hey guys, it's Aaron from eugamehost.com um, and this super quick video I'm just going to be uh, showing you how to do a simple loot multiplier on your Rust server. So a lot of people if you've been asking about this, um, there's more complicated ways, there's alpha loot, there's better loot, things like that, right? But this is just going to be the most simple way to do a simple loot multiplier. Um, so we're going to need two things for this, we're going to need a plugin and we're going to need umod. Um, so we're going to go to the mod manager here, you can obviously download uh, umod directly from umod.org yourself and apply it to your dedicated server, but in the case of this we're going to install it via our panel. Um, in here you can uh, click, simply click install here, I've previously done this already um, for the sake of this video. Um, so we're going to go back in here, and after the first server boot, if you go into the file manager, you will see the Oxide folder. Um, in here, you go to Oxide, and then Plugins, and then you can upload any plugins you download in here. But for our wonderful clients, we do indeed have something called the UMod Plugin Installer. Um, it, it's, it's a browser, um, it makes life a little easier, and uh, I will just have to find it now. I appear to have gone slightly blind. There we go, Install UMod Plugins. Sorry, I couldn't even see what it was on our own panel. Um, so we're going to install UMod Plugins here, and this will load up the uh, UI for this. There we go, it's now loading up, it's got a lot to load. And we're just going to look, we're going to, in the search bar, we're going to type in Simple Loot. If I can spell, Simple Loot, and then we can click Search. And uh, we'll get this here, Simple Loot here, and we'll click Install. This is now going to download that directly from umod.org and install it on your server. It saves you any muggering about. And uh, is, uh, it's just nice for looking through to find new plugins as well. That's why I like it. Back when I used to run my own Rust servers, I was uh, a big fan of that. Go to the File Manager here. In here, we're going to look for the Oxide folder, and we're going to look for the config. In here, you'll see the new Simple Loot.Johnson. So um, this will have automatically generated um, upon the uh, server loading and compiling the plugin for us. We're going to right click. And we're going to click edit and this plugin can't be simpler it is absolutely brilliant so it's going to obviously going to affect loot crates and barrels and that kind of stuff on your server and you can come through here and you can just select the multipliers you know it's that easy so you've got your defaults in here so if we want to set this to a two times server we're going to come in and we're literally just going to change the ones to twos be careful not to remove the commas um a lot of people you know don't be sloppy about it and expect it to work um, but just be careful to leave the commas in, and you know, I'm not going to do all of these, but you know, that's enough for the uh, my demonstration. And then we're going to click save, and it's that simple. Um, now we're just going to quickly jump over to our Archon here, and we're going to reload the plugin. I'll show you how to do a, a basic reload of your plugin here. So we're going to log into our, you know, Aaron's even cooler server um, via Archon. We're going to go to the console section, and we're going to type oxide.reload, and then we're just going to type a star to reload the entire server. Um, but obviously, if you specify the plugin name, you can do just that. So in this case, it would be oxide dot reload uh, simple loot. There you go, and that's reloaded that. So that server will now be two times on the, those particular multipliers, and you can go through and set that on anything you want. But yeah, any questions about our server hosting, just let us know. There's going to be a discount code for you guys down in the description. Um, if you wanted to grow your server faster, do please consider EU Game Host. Um, we offer a, a real value-packed service with the you know the A2S caching for globally lower ping. Your server's going to display faster in the browser, and uh, you know you're going to hopefully get more players. But have a good one, guys. Thank you.